buzz and cows, my name is Otto C and welcome back to another episode of the Hardcore Challenge Season 2. Uh, so far we did not die. However, since last time um, I said I was going to do a bit of fishing, um, did not do a lot of uh, fishing because if you look at the uh, XP bar, I am over uh, 30 XP and uh, if we are sinking uh, enchanting, right, uh, uh, for the max level, uh, we would need a 30 level and with each level, uh, to reach the next upper level you need more XP points so there is really not much of a point uh, going uh, collecting more uh, XP than 30 especially if you have uh, uh, such a slow process uh, like fishing to do it however what I did do was uh, I collected a few uh, uh, logs, planted a few saplings back here, bred up some uh, cows so we can have a nice uh, uh, cow farm going back here uh, and of course that's for all the, uh, the leather we want to collect for our uh, for our books so instead of uh, fishing and uh, farming I think we shall have a look at the villages over there uh, if we can get a good trade out of them and uh, also at the uh, broken up portal maybe we could even uh, collect a bit of uh, obsidian so we can craft an enchanting table and then eventually we will have enough books um, so we can uh, get the bookshelves for our enchanting area so uh, as you see in here, I have made a lectern and a barrel um, so we can see if uh, we can get any good trades from any of the uh, villages. So let's try breed up a few more cows. Um, this will go on uh, for quite a while. Uh, but it will end us with, with quite a bit of leather. Back here we have a small farm, so let's nip. A few of the of the carrots so we can have a carrot plantation going ourselves we will be friendly enough and replant uh, we can also have a few potatoes um, I don't really care for the, uh, the, the beetroot. However, I am not seeing a farmer over here. This is the village with all the uh, leather, leather worker. Uh, which uh, are useful when you have an abundance of leather but uh, for the moment 
uh, we have uh, more need for the ladder uh, with regards to uh, books. So let's see if we can entice a few of these to become something else. For example, a librarian would be nice. Or um, I also have a barrel in here, so we can also have a fisherman. Of course, librarian, um, we want to have uh, one with, with a decent trade. So let's put the barrel here. And we have the fisherman there, uh, who accepts coal. I think we can get a better first trade. And I am wondering if you mine a cauldron full of water. Where does the water go? So let's try and come up with a different trade for the fishermen goal and that's even worse what do you give me now still the coal I will take the coal, but uh, uh, basically the uh, uh, the emerald for a uh, uh, bucket of cod string for emerald. We do not have any string. String and coal. Okay, let's go for it. Um, let's get bit more coal okay our first emeralds and on here we can trade some of our cards and hopefully leveling him up in due time. Um, then do we have already a farmer going on somewhere? Yes, now we have uh, potatoes for emeralds. Um, I don't think so. Um, Let's try this again, shall we? Wheat, yeah, that would be an option. However, um, I need the wheat mainly for the for the cows. Now that's that's battle, right? Um, we can plant some uh, some carrots uh, over on our side. Paper and um, emeralds for bookshelf. I think for a first librarian that is okay. So I heard some spiders. They're probably underground somewhere here.
inside a bit of a convoluted cave here. And we get out this way. Yes. Looks like it. Um, this is a church, so we should have a cleric, which is great news because clerics uh, trade um, uh, trade. Uh, ooh, obsidian, bit of gold, bit of bread, saplings, apples. We will take all. We'll leave the saplings. We do have a, a few trees going. We have two farmers. The other one has the, the potato trade. And we do also have a few uh, uh, potatoes, so we can, we can plant them as well. So let's get back to our farm. Um, do a bit more breeding uh, on the cows, plant a few more carrots and potatoes so they can grow. I need two grown-up cows to breed. You and you. And here we have two more cows. Back here are still a few more. And soon I think we shall have enough uh, to begin the uh, slaughtering without decimating our uh, uh, amount of cows too much. You always have to consider that you have to uh, uh, breed them up again. So, um, let's do the harvesting here. A bit more weeds so we can breed a few more cows. Um, Here we can have a bit of a larger area for more farms. Let's prepare that. Um, here we want carrots and potatoes. Yep. Also collect a bit of sugar cane. Pumpkin, there's Max, there it is. All right, and then let's put a few things away in the chest. Don't need the flower. Oh, I already have some paper, so we could have traded um, with the villager back there, uh, the obsidian, a uh, bit low on coal, so let's put that away. And then we shall have a look at the... Uh, 
broken nether portal back here. I never had a closer look at one since they were added to the game. But I think there is a chest that comes with the gate. And quite a deep hole on this side. Um, there is a chest. A flint and steel is good. There's a golden block there. Bit of lava. So I think uh, we can use this lava to create um, the missing obsidian. Uh, we're a bit hungry, so. Um, Ouch! That was uh, a magma block. Let's get more cows over to our side. Or maybe uh, let's just lot of them here. Stop running around. You're harder to hit that way. Um, because getting them over the water can be a bit tricky. And I think we have a few cows on the other side that we can uh, actually breed up. So maybe it takes a tiny bit longer that way, um, but we can save us the hassle to ferry over the cows over this smallish body of water and then we shall continue with uh, enchanting trading with villagers um, all the liberia uh, let's use a word that i can actually use the long work uh, to get uh, ourselves uh, set up for the uh, final mission. We need to go to the uh, end for some uh, blaze powder or uh, blaze rods that we can convert into uh, blaze rods uh, so we can get eyes of ender and then we shall go and find ourselves a stronghold but we're not quite there yet so i say let's get this uh, obsidian uh, stuff figured out we need a diamond picks for mining the obsidian and we need a water bucket for more obsidian so let's head over to that broken gate and deal with it. Okay, we have lava right on this side. So let's first convert all this to uh, obsidian. So that when we mine the obsidian up above here um, and the obsidian drops down, it does not end up in lava destroying itself. So mining obsidian is um, boring task as it takes quite a while for the blocks to break especially without enchanted pick 
or uh, haste beacon. We should get quite a few obsidian blocks out of this. We can leave the uh, crying obsidian. They are nice to look at, but we do not need them to create a portal. There is another gold block under there. We can also collect the gold to make up for the not quite two stacks we did not manage to collect when mining. So one gold block means nine more ingots of gold. So should get all the gold that we need. One more obsidian block up there. Then, frankly, I'm not sure if the uh, there is more lava down there, so let's place a bit of water before mining. As I said, this is the first time I take a close look at the uh, broken nether portal. And it looks like it's just one block deep. There is more netherrack down there. Let's collect Ouch. Let's collect the water. And then we can mine the rest of the obsidian and see how much we get out of this. We came out with more than half a stack of uh, obsidian and we have three more in there. So that should be enough for a portal and an enchanting table. So enchanting table is sorted uh, with the portal. We will wait until we actually uh, are ready to make that move. But uh, for now, uh, we have to do a bit more farming, uh, breeding the cows, getting more leather, uh, converting more sugarcane to uh, uh, paper uh, and all the good stuff so we can stock up on uh, books, bookshelves, so we can finally do some enchanting and then uh, getting on with villager trading. But that will have to wait for the next episode. So see you then. Goodbye.